Hey guys, welcome to vidichacademy.com and here in this video we are going to discuss few examples on trigonometric functions. So here the given example is find the range of 13 cos x plus 3 root 3 sin x minus 4. And now let us write this function as f of x is equal to 13 cos x plus 3 root 3 sin x minus 4. And now let us rearrange. So here we get 3 root 3 sin x plus 13 cos x minus 4. And now let us compare this function with the functions a sin x plus b cos x plus c. So here by comparing both the functions we get a equal to 3 root 3 and the value of b will be equal to 13 and the value of c is minus 4. And we already know the formula to find the minimum value of the trigonometric functions. So minimum value is given by the formula c minus under root a square plus b square. And then substituting all the values of a comma b comma c in the formula we get here c that is minus 4 minus under root a square plus b square that is 3 root 3 whole square plus b square that is 13 square here. So that implies we get here minus 4 and minus under root 3 root 3 whole square that is 9 into 3 that is 27. So we get 27 plus square of 13 which is 169. So that implies we get here minus 4 minus under root the addition of 27 plus 169 which is 196. So that implies we get here minus 4 minus square root of 196 that is 14. So minus 4 minus 14 will be equal to minus 18. And now let us find the maximum value. So maximum value of the function is given by the formula c plus under root a square plus b square. And now by substituting the values of c and a comma b in the formula we get minus 4 plus under root 3 root 3 whole square plus 13 square. So that implies we get here minus 4 plus under root 3 root 3 square which is 27 plus 13 square which is 169. And here by adding we get minus 4 plus under root 196. So that implies we get here minus 4 plus square root of 196 which is 14. And here we get minus 4 plus 14 which is 10. So 10 is the maximum value of the given function. And here we have to find the range. So range of f of x will be equal to c minus under root a square plus b square comma c plus under root a square plus b square. That is minimum value comma maximum value. So that implies we get here minus 18 comma 10 as the range of the function f of x. And now let us proceed and discuss one more example. So here given example is find the range of 7 cos x minus 24 sin x plus 5. So now let us name this function as f of x. So here we get let f of x is equal to 7 cos x minus 24 sin x plus 5. And now let us rearrange this. So by rearranging we get here minus 24 sin x plus 7 cos x plus 5. And now let us compare the given function with a sin x plus b cos x plus c. And here by comparing we get the value of a as minus 24 and the value of b as 7 and the value of c is equal to 5 here. And then we already know the formula of minimum value. So minimum value of the function can be found by the formula c minus under root a square plus b square. And then substituting all the values of a comma b comma c we get here c that is 5 minus under root a square that is minus 24 whole square plus b square that is 7 square. So that implies we get here 5 minus under root minus 24 square that is nothing but 576 plus square of 7 that is 49. And here by adding we get 5 minus under root 625. So that implies we get here 5 minus square root of 625 which is 25. And here by subtracting we get the minimum value as minus 20. And now let us find the maximum value. So maximum value is given by the formula c plus under root a square plus b square and then substituting the values we get here 5 plus under root a square that is minus 24 square which is equal to 576 plus b square that is 7 square which is 49. And here by adding we get 5 plus under root 625. 
So that implies we get here 5 plus square root of 625, which is 25. And here by adding, we get 5 plus 25, which is 30. So 30 is the maximum value. So hence, we can say that range of the given function f of x will be equal to minus 20, comma 30. So make a note of the formula that the minimum value of the f of x is given by the formula c minus a square plus b square and the maximum value of the function is given by the formula c plus under root a square plus b square. So this was the basic introduction on how to solve examples on extreme values of trigonometric functions. Hope you understood the concept. Refer more videos on trigonometry on our website bdjacademy.com. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.